Yeah, so obviously, like, my final piece is, like, comprised of... There's the dolls that I've got, and then there's the, like, garment. So, um, like, my focus is on, like, fashion, really, um, and kind of, like, exploring that on, like, a miniature scale with the dolls, and then, like, a sort of human scale with the garments. Um, but kind of, like, carrying the themes of, like, dolls and kind of, like, I guess, like, self-image, self-expression at, like, diff different scales and how we kind of, like, um, condense that in certain ways, like, through, like, fashion or, like, representations of ourselves in, like, different ways. So it's kind of about, like, exploring, like, my own identity, my own, like, um, ideas about, like, fashion and stuff in these kind of, like, different formats, kind of. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of like a mixture of things, I would say. Like, I think I'd always had a bit of a fascination with, like, dolls like that, especially, like, Bratz dolls, because I was, like, not really allowed them as a child. Um, so I think it's almost kind of like healing my inner child a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it's been great. Yeah, it's been honestly, like, such a growth year, I would say, in, like, every way, really. Like, if I think about my, like visual language like my I guess just like my practice in general and also like my just sense of myself as an artist like at the beginning of the course compared to now is like drastically different <laughs> but like in the best way a level art for me at least was like it was good but it was like completely different to the foundation um, I feel like foundation is like so much freer <laughs> And like, I feel like the focus is really on just like letting you do completely what you want to do um, and like helping you achieve that more than anything else really. So I think it's just cool being surrounded by like other creative people that are all kind of like at that same stage in life as well. Um, I mean like the school that I went to, like I stayed on the same school for sick form and there was like a uniform there as well, which was like not very fun for me. <laughs> so even just like every day, like choosing outfits and there's like zero judgment and stuff, it's like good fun. <laughs> yeah, so I'm doing um, fashion design at Manchester Met. Um, yeah, very hyped for it, very excited. <laughs> I'm super ready for it, yeah, because like I think I've been like into fashion and kind of wanting to do it for like quite a long time but like this year I feel like getting to really like explore it in more depth and like find out more about like what my style is what I want to do I think going on to like a specialist course where I can actually learn like construction skills about the industry like the history of fashion like all of that is just like super exciting oh I'm definitely nervous yeah <laughs> I would say just like don't stress about it so much because it's like I think it's easy to go into something like this and be like oh like I have to try and be the best I have to like try and stick out from the crowd and like everyone's gonna be so good like all of this but it's like I think everyone like all of the tutors and everything like they really just want to like bring the best out of you um, and I think it's like the most important thing is just to be like open and just like give things a go and try and just like be as real with yourself as you can about like what you actually want to do without trying to like fit into an idea of like oh this is something that's going to impress people or like people are going to understand this it's going to make sense to people be like i don't know the idea of what you should be doing I think just like trying to really like key into like what actually excites you and makes sense for you is like the way to go. 